Now this here may make some people mad, but here's the thing, <laughs> I'm okay with that. So let's get into it, family. So the last time I checked, what made one a Christian was acknowledging that there was a God that loves us despite us. We are sinners in desperate need of a savior. And then God in his graciousness sent his son Jesus to die on the cross so that we would have an opportunity to live. And in that we are to repent of our sins and commit our lives to loving God and loving people. There's not one human being on this planet that is perfect. Yet I see people using their accounts and have the nerve to tear down and question somebody else's Christianity because they sin differently than you. Who are you to judge others? Who are you to condemn people to hell? And Jesus say that the teachers of the law in John 8, let any one of you without sin cast the first stone. Doesn't it say in Luke 6, do not judge and you will not be judged. Do not condemn and you will not be condemned. Doesn't it say in Matthew 7, why do you look at the speck of sawdust in your neighbor's eye and pay no attention to the plank in your own eye? In Matthew 22, it says we are called to love God and love people. We are to be a light in darkness and look at us. And we wonder why people run away from the faith. I'm sick of so-called Christians spreading hateful messages, mass and spiritual superiority, using verses out of context to solidify their hateful narrative. That ain't got nothing to do with the heart and mission of Jesus and the gospel. 